Okay, um, in this video we're going to take a look at um, a common question that comes up um, and that's it concerns the power loss in uh, power lines. So we're talking about um, power lines in the national grid. Now there's often um, a confusion between the formula for power um, uh, which is P equals current times voltage and um, this other one P equals I, uh, I squared R. Um, now, in overhead power lines in the national grid, we may have very, very high voltages. Um, for example, I put here 300,000 volts. Um, and um, from this value of voltage and this value of current, we can use this uh, equation P equals I times V to actually um, to find the uh, power, the trans transmitted, so that's the amount of energy per second transmitted over the power lines. So we could plug in the numbers, um, so the current is 3 times 300,000, okay, it was obviously um, <coughs> 900,000 watts, okay. This is the transmitted uh, power. Um, the other formula um, concerns um, the power wasted, so the power loss due to heating of the wire. Um, they may, for example, tell you that the wire um, has a certain resistance. So in this case, I've put um, 0 0.03 ohms for every kilometer. So let's say we have 10 kilometers of wire, um, and let's work out the power loss um, in a 10 kilometer wire. So 10 kilometer wire uh, would have a resistance of um, 10 times 0.03, okay, which is going to be 0.3 uh, ohms. Um, and then we can use this formula uh, to calculate the power loss due to heating in the wire. Okay, so we can use um, P equals I squared, we've got the same current. 3 squared times 0 0.3 okay, equals, um, equals um, 2.7 2 watts. Um, so this we use for transmitted power and this voltage is the, uh, the voltage that we're um, transmitting the um, electricity at and uh, we use this formula for the power loss, okay, due to heating of the wire. Okay, do not um, muddle them up. 